Hi, I'm Michael Finucane. My in-ring name is The Ringer Mickey Vaughn. I'm from Avon Lake, Ohio, which is in the United States of America. I'm 240 pounds, six feet tall. I work at Nutrition Zone where I'm a sales rep and I work as a personal trainer at Competition Bodies. I believe I should be in the WWE because I bring a unique product to the market. Um, not only do I believe that I, you know, have what it takes, um, I believe I have a look. I have a, you know, a certain balance that, uh, you know, wrestlers need. My style of wrestling is intense. A very intense person. I show that in my interviews. I bring a lot of passion and heart to my character. My character is off the wall. My character is bringing out, you know, his rage. Um, and when I talk about who I'm going up against next, I want my audience to believe that this guy is so crazy. This guy is so insane that nobody can touch him. Nobody can 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 take him on a one-on-one -on -one platform. My improv skills on the mic and inside the ring are quite witty. Once I get into character, as far as breaking out of the character, I, no, there's there's absolutely no way. I mean, you give me a, uh, you give me a, a, a dumbbell and uh, maybe a protein shake and uh, no, it's on, it's on. As far as wrestling training goes, three days a week, two days with the school, um, one day with uh, a few of my buddies that are, are also part of the school. Um, and, you know, I really believe that it's fun. You know, I love getting in the ring. Um, you know, there's always things to be learned. As far as my work ethic in the gym, um, you know, I train hard. But I'm not some kind of typical meathead. I do find balance in, in what I do, and, and, and I try to find, uh, you know, it necessary. I, I try to joke around as much as possible. What's going through your mind? This, what is this animal listening to in his iPod? And to tell you the complete honest truth, I'm actually listening to, believe it or not, Mandy more candy. My hometown uh, in Avon Lake, as far as, uh, you know, what it's all about, I, you know, it's, it's a smaller town. It's like Mayberry out here. Nothing ever happens. Somebody's first impression of me is, uh, you know, they get intimidated by my size. Um, once they get to talking to me and once they, you know, realize what kind of person I am, they uh, start to realize that I'm a, a goofball, you know, and I like to, you know, have fun and, you know, do things that, uh, you know, normal people don't find funny. Probably wondering what I'm doing here in this cold weather. My mother doesn't have a centerpiece for the dinner table. We're days away from Christmas. <laughs> I don't want to ruin the surprise just yet. But we're gonna catch a turkey. <laughs> a little bit ago, we were, we were spotted. So we're right here in some roughage. And I'm just gonna, well, I'm just gonna go for it. Well, you learn something new every day. Not only are they fast, they can fly. My God, well. That took a lot out of me. Boy, I'll tell you, this cold doesn't help anything. <laughs> I don't act my age, and I, I don't think I ever will. And, um, you know, shame on anybody that says that you have to act a certain age because I'll probably be acting 13 when I'm 60. I come from a single family. I have a brother and a sister. It was always tough growing up. My dad was there up until I was 11. Um, but he was never there. I mean, he paid the bills and that was it. He was never a father. But my mom held it together and uh, made sure that, you know, there was always food on the table. And as far as, you know, my mom, my sister, my brother being behind me, um, they're, they're behind me 110%. Um, they, was, they were always supportive, you know, in, in my successes and in my failures. Um, I'd say more so than, than others. One of my favorite things to do is uh, impressions. Hi, you might not recognize me in this light, but I am the governor of California, Arnold Schwarzenegger. And I'd like to talk to you about extra virgin coconut oil. For all you women out there, it is the richest moisturizer in the world. You can put this shit in your hair. You can, you can rub it on your balls if you like. It, you, can, you, can t you can take a big glob, stick it on your ass pipe, and have some guy eat it out. And he's going to love it because it's rich in medium train triglycerides. My other favorite impersonation would have to be Matt Foley. Uh, played by Chris Farley. Uh, if you don't know who Matt Foley is, I you might not be an American. Yeah, I believe that I could take it out on some of those young punks. I mean, because let's face it, nobody has ever seen a physique like mine. 5'9", 350 pounds of speedballs and cocaine girls. I don't really know what the hell I just said this there, but I'll tell you right now. You give me a shot on uh, Tough Enough, I'm going to take out the opposition. I'm going to make them feel my pain. Yeah. <laughs>
Oh, yeah, let me tell you something about the Macho Man Randy Savage, you see? All these guys that are coming out and looking for a contract uh, through the WWE and uh, tough enough, see, they don't know and realize that it takes hard work and dedication, yeah. All the years of training that goes into snapping Slim Jims and curling the weights, yeah. Some people can't handle the bright lights. But I'm not like some people. I am the ringer, Mickey Vaughn. And as I stare into this light, I see my future. And that is why I have to wear these shades. It is so bright, so blinding, that when I remove them, you do not see my pupils restricting. They are dilating. They are letting in all of that light. So I hope after reviewing what you just saw, you will have enough knowledge to do the right thing. I will, you and all the others, realize that I have what it takes to be in the WWE. I have what it takes to take on all opposition. I have what it takes to rip up buildings from their foundations. I am the missing link, the key to the brightness that you see before you. And let me tell you something, if what I just showed you there isn't what you want, then you better look somewhere else because you're not going to get anybody with this type of rage, this type of intensity. And if that ain't tough enough, I don't know what is.